Hello, my friends. My name is Jason, and thanks for checking out our midweek devotional. This Sunday, we wrapped up our series on Romans 8, we called The Best Chapter Ever. I was thinking about Sunday's message and wondering, am I the only one that will sometimes let the mistakes of my past, both distant and recent, keep me from experiencing God's love today? Maybe it's just me, but often it's just really easy for me to think that when my life circumstances are not ideal, to think, maybe God loves me less or doesn't care about me at all. This lie can cripple us into living discouraged, hopeless lives or to strive to earn something that honestly, we're just not capable of earning. I have to remind myself, and really I want to remind you today, that God's love is not like human love. Our view of God's love is often tainted by the relationships that we have here on earth, right? The love that we have for our spouses, our children, family, friends. The love we feel and choose in these relationships is always based on something, whether it's a relation or shared experience or an attraction. But the love of God is not based on these things or these circumstances or these experiences because it's a part of the character of God. It literally is who God is. God is love. And I'm grateful for Romans 8.39 today that tells us, that reminds us Nothing in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Nothing, no thing, no thing can separate us. His love is no beginning or end. He simply cannot and will not stop loving us. So today, spend some time in prayer. Thank God for His unending love for you, for humanity, for the world. And find a way today to reflect God's unfailing love to the people around you. Who knows? Maybe someone in your world needs to hear today that nothing, no thing, could separate them from the love of their Creator.